What's up, everybody? Welcome to another episode of the Knowledge Bar. Boo! What's up? All right, today we're going to go over a QL move. Now, historically, I've never really done weighted side bend shit because well, I'll take the shirt off, so I'll show you. Frank Zane said back in the day, we never wanted to do anything to widen our waist. We only wanted to do like twisting type shit. But the QL, which is like right there, which most people's lower backs hurt from that, get weak sometimes. Now, me having like ego lifter, I thought I'd just get on the side bend machine, the lower back machine, I could just do these things, but my shit got kind of weak. But this standing feels really good. Shout out Ben Patrick, I saw him doing these standing and it's actually been a better scale for me, even though my abs, you know, are there, but this shit is kind of weak. So now what he said was make sure that you go uh, stagger your feet. So there's also like, I guess an element of like balance. Then you're going to go the dumbbell in the same arm as the back foot. Okay. That's kind of key to get the stretch. Then you're going to come down. So like right here, you're going to try to find where is that spot where I, you'll be able to feel where it's kind of tight to kind of stretch and then up and then you can go here if you want. So I'll go like this to try to feel where that spot is and then up. And I'll go 10 to 12 each side. I'm literally only using 15 pounds. So this really isn't like an aesthetic exercise. This is more of like a stability and like get your shit together strength exercise, which will help all my wide stance squats, sumo deadlifts, everything. So right here, I can feel this side is weaker and tighter. So if shit's tight, one of the sides, if not the side that's tight, is probably weak too. And then I'll switch my feet. And then same thing. Now on this side, I have way more mobility. I can feel it. It doesn't feel as tight, but literally like a couple sets of 15, usually after my conditioning, just to kind of touch this up. And then one day a week, I'll go a little bit heavier and try to push. But this is my standing QL side bend, anti 1970s bodybuilding thing. Why I never did this shit, but it's impactful and it helps a lot. Check it out. <laughs> 